Ever since I installed this fire door magnet, I've been curious as to how much power it uses. So today I'm going to use my kilowatt device to find out. I've got this convenient switch to turn the magnet on and off, so I'm going to use that to my advantage. And I'm going to hook up the kilowatt to the fire panel and then turn the magnet on and off to see how much that uses. So I've just connected the fire panel to the kilowatt. It's reading 15 watts, which is pretty decent because obviously nothing's happening. Uh, so let's turn that magnet on. Right now there's nothing attached to the magnet, so... Still at 15 watts, so it doesn't look like that magnet really is drawing anything yet. Now let's put the door on and see if that makes it draw power. Still at 15. So it doesn't look like these magnets really use power. Well, I mean, obviously they're using power, but not a lot of power because clearly they, there isn't much of a difference. Like if I turn that magnet off and release this door, we're still at 15 watts. So the moral is adding one of these magnets to your fire system won't use a lot. I had initially assumed that having an electromagnet would at least add like one watt or so, but doesn't look like it makes a big difference at all however i'm assuming if you had like a building full of these you know you had like i don't know 60 or so i guess that would probably add up but clearly this one just having one uh doesn't really affect how much power there is so you can safely use your magnets and not have to worry about driving up the cost of your electric bill which is nice there it is just for fun let's go ahead and alarm the system to see if that makes it draw a ton of power so we're gonna go ahead and trigger a pull station <laughs> 38 watts <laughs> 